all sorts of islands, imaginary islands, islands for sale, floating islands, and there are also ghost islands. According to reports from navigators, there are a good 40 of them. In 2012, Sandy Island was the latest to appear on the list. 25 meters long, it haunts the Coral Sea halfway between Australia and New Caledonia. It made its first appearance in 1876 when the Australian whale ship, the Velocity, spotted it. Sandy Islets was officially listed in the Australian Maritime Logbook in 1879. Since then, Sandy Island has been put on the maps, listed amongst others in the Times World Atlas, Google Maps, it is even shown on satellite images of Google Earth. The Aeronaval military looked for it in vain in French territorial waters and removed it from maritime maps in 1979. But it reappeared in 2000. An amateur radio crew took off with the idea of broadcasting from this far-off island, but they never found it. In 2012, an oceanographic team from the University of Sydney set off once more to find it. Waves, the ocean, the island was hiding. They sounded the seabeds around the area and discovered depths of around 1,400 meters. So it hadn't been swallowed up. The Landsat infrared signal confirmed this. So while everyone was talking about it, Sandy disappeared once more from maps and screens. All explorers dream of discovering an unknown land, but Sandy Island, the ghost island, is playing hard to get.